Sometimes shopping at a huge warehouse store like Costco can make you feel pretty small. But at the Costco in Danville, there's an employee who makes everyone there feel important. And KTV's John Sasaki tells us that employee is now facing some serious challenges, all of which prompted some of his customers to give him a big surprise. As shoppers ebb and flow at the Danville Costco, one of the first and last people they see is 45-year-old Arlie Smith. He's always at the door, he's always giving receipts, always smiling, always happy, and people refer to him as the Costco guy. Arlie has worked at the store for 21 years, but not without challenges. He was diagnosed with primary progressive MS. Multiple sclerosis. Then last September, his body threw him an even bigger curveball. He has terminal bone cancer, now with maybe two years to live. Since the time he was told that, he has been enthusiastic and happy, and I'm not kidding. Arlie is such a beloved figure that some customers heard about the cancer and decided to do something nice for him. What are we doing? At 1 p.m., they invaded the store. We are all here today because we love you so much. They raised about $2,500 to send Arlie and his wife on a vacation. We've all banded together, and um, we got people donating $10, $20, up to $500 for you and Sherry to go and have a four night at your favorite place in Laguna Beach. Arlie, who grew up in San Ramon, was overwhelmed. They're priceless. I, they're irreplaceable. And his humility was obvious. Everything that's done for me and the love that's shown to me every day, it's astounding. I mean, people don't have this great of a life, really. Despite living with MS and terminal cancer, Arlie couldn't be more positive about life. It's in your face all the time. So how can you possibly be ungrateful in my situation? How can you possibly take this for granted? And I don't think I ever saw him grapple with the why me. I mean, he went like immediately to, you know, finding a bigger purpose for what he can do. His purpose now is to raise as much money as possible during a storewide fundraiser in May for Children's Hospital, a fundraiser in which he has previously finished in the top 10 in North America. A Greek philosopher once said, it's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. Arlie is clearly a personification of that idea. In Danville, I'm John Sasaki, KTVU, Fox 2 News. That has to be one of the nicest stories I've seen in a while. You know, the Kardashians get so much publicity. <laughs> That's the kind of guy I admire. That, that, that was just really something. Oh, Arlie's amazing. Thank you also, John Sasaki, for that story. Yeah.